everybody. Welcome to the Wikimedia 2022 Global Hackathon. My name is Haley, and I work on the developer advocacy team here at the Wikimedia Foundation. I also want to introduce you to this year's amazing Hackathon Organizing Committee. James, Sele, Chico, Neslihan, Lucas, Gopa, Jay, Andre, and myself. And we've also had quite a lot of help from Marios. Hackathons are collaborative events where people from the Wikimedia technical community come together to connect, work on projects, discuss ideas, learn new things, and have fun. This year's hackathon is unique. It's the first time that the event happens in a hybrid format. We have lots of people coming together online, and there are people all around the world meeting up in person. I want to give a special welcome to the newcomers joining us today. If this is your first hackathon, come find us in the online space and say hello. There are many people who would love to meet you. We hope you can check out the newcomer's social, some of the newcomer's sessions, and work on some projects. For more information, look at the newcomers page on the website. Welcome also to returning hackathon attendees. We're so glad you're joining us again. We hope that you enjoy the game space that the committee has built and hope you can meet some of the very diverse participants from around the world. If you have time, maybe you can also stop by the newcomers room and share some wisdom with the new folks. Finally, welcome to the attendees of the 12 plus local meetups. We have people meeting up in at least seven, maybe eight, maybe nine countries around the world. Uh, if you attend a local meetup and you have any ideas or feedback, or if you're a purely online participant, do feel free to talk to me, comment on the hackathon talk page, or reach out to dev-advocacy at wikimedia.org. And that email address is also on the website. If you're like me and you're not attending any local meetups, check out the cantina in the game space. That's where people will be coming together for social activities online. At the end of the event, we will come together to present the projects we've worked on. If you'd like to participate in this showcase, you can sign up on MediaWiki. The link is on the main hackathon page. We ask that you keep presentations under three minutes long so everyone has time to present. If you don't want to present, still consider coming to support others. Before we get started, we'll show you some basics on how you can participate in the hackathon. Welcome again. We're so glad you're here. Happy hacking. During this hackathon, there will be two sets of main hours for sessions and social events. First is between 3 and 6 GMT, and the second is between 15 and 19 GMT. The core hours on Friday and Saturday will be open for sessions and hacking. On the other hand, the core hours on Sunday will be used for showcasing projects and closing ceremony. Outside of these hours, you're welcome to stay in our online space. Sessions will take place in virtual rooms in the hackathon game space. We have community building room where topics like ethics, biases, accessibility will be talked. Then we have infrastructure room where we will be talking about Fabricator, Git, Garrett, GitLab or Dev Portal there. Next room is localization and small wikis room, which is about localization, translation of tools and small wikis. Then we have media wiki room, obviously for topics related to media wiki. We also have Python room where you can find sessions about Pose, PyWiki board, etc. Also, we have Wikibase and Wikidata room where you can find data related topics. Last but not least, we have Cantina social room where social events will occur. You can schedule your session to empty slots. Details about how to do that are explained in the web page. Here on the table, in the first row, you will see the rooms that we have just mentioned. And ours are in the first column. All the times here are in UTC, but you can simply click and see it in your own time zone. If you're like me, you probably just entered the game space. When you enter, you'll be in this sort of yellow room. There's this little map on the ground, which shows where all the different hackathon rooms will take place. When you use the arrows on your keyboard or your finger on your mobile phone, you can move your little avatar around. I'm here in a rainbow shirt with my orange cat. 
I have an orange cat in real life. His name is Rocket. This here to the left is the help and moderation room. If you need any help during the hackathon or you have concerns about moderation, come on in. When you enter, it will open a Jitsi space, which is a video conferencing space. Someone from the Wikimedia Foundation will be there to answer your questions. This is actually the case when you enter any of the rooms. Here to the right, we have the cantina, which is where a lot of social sessions will take place. It will also open a room. When you walk up to some of the things on the walls, you might notice that they open links. This one will open the schedule, which will help you review what sessions are available at different times of day. By the way, if you click on this link, it will actually show you what time it is in your time zone. When you walk away, the window will close. I encourage you to explore the space. The rooms are on the sides. Also, if you see another person, such as this avatar, Melinda, and you walk up to them, it will actually open a little video chat with that person. These can only hold up to four people, so if you want to talk to more than four people, we encourage you to go into some of the empty hacking rooms. So this one is an open hacking room, which will open an empty Jitsi room, and there will be no session scheduled in that space. Same for over here in the newcomer space. Please do walk around and see what you can find. If you can actually also leave the online space and go, or excuse me, the indoor space and go into the outdoor space where there's lots of little things happening that you can go and explore. If you walk up to certain objects, you might notice surprises come up. Hackathon attendees track what they work on in tasks in Fabricator. Fabricator is linked from the Hackathon wiki page. The tasks are shown on a workboard. If you are new to Fabricator, check the help page first. If you work on something at the Hackathon, create a new task in Fabricator. Enter a task title and a summary for your work. Optionally, add another project tag for a related code base. Then set yourself as task assignee and create the new task. If you work on an already existing Fabricator task, add the Hackathon project tag and set yourself as task assignee. On the Hackathon workboard, make sure the task is in the Hacking Projects column. You can also find general projects and interests of Hackathon attendees on the Participants page on the wiki. Hi everyone! Thank you for joining us for this year's Wikimedia Hackathon. We're very excited to have you here, and one of our goals is for you to have a great time either in a social room or in one of our sessions. But before we get started, we'd like to talk to you about our Friendly Space Policy and the Code of Conduct for Technical Spaces. Our Friendly Space Policy is dedicated to providing a harassment-free experience for all people at all venues and events, and it applies to everyone attending them. We do not tolerate any form of harassment of participants. Participants asked to stop any harassing behavior are expected to comply immediately. Any participants violating these rules may be sanctioned or expelled from the event. So if you have any doubts about what harassment means, please visit the Friendly Space Policy page. You can find the link at the end of this video. With the Code of Conduct, we are committed to making participation in Wikimedia technical spaces a respectful and harassment-free experience for everyone as well. This social agreement applies both to people in technical physical spaces and virtual spaces. We like to foster an open and welcoming community here, so remember that technical skills and community status make no difference to the right to be respected and the obligation to respect others. Everyone here deserves a welcoming attitude and the opportunity to receive constructive feedback. Please take a time to review this important information. You can find it in the following links. If you would like to make a report, please go to our help desk. You can also send us an email at dev-advocacy at wikimedia.org.